planting some vegetables. Louder. We are planting veggies. I don't have my gardening gloves, so I'll go get them. Tina, Tina, what do you think? Yeah. Denim, come over here, Mama. Come on, Demi. Come here, Mama. Come on. Planting veggies today. We're starting our first fall garden. We have had many spring gardens, and by many, I mean like three or four. Um, so we're starting a fall garden today, right, Demi? We have lettuce that we bought as a starter plant. We have kale, we have blue kale, we have scotch kale, arugula, onion chives, onion chives that we started from the little basil from Walmart. Yeah, we bought that basil at Walmart. Some and parsley. Well, no. And the parsley we started from seeds. Oh, my bad. So I was just introducing the stuff that's already like pre-started. Oh, sorry. That's, that's all right. Um, so this is a uh, mustard or turnips. I done lost my little. We're planting mustard, mustard greens, turnips. Oh, Demi likes the scotch kale. We've never grown kale before. So it's gonna be a first. We're pretty excited about it. So um, yeah, we're just gonna put this in the ground and that's pretty much gonna be it. Oh, thanks Demi. Thank you. It says that, uh, we were reading earlier, it says that uh, most, all these plants are pretty much companion plants. I really wanted to put the basil in here because it's, it's supposed to keep bugs away. It smells so beautiful and delicious. Oh my gosh. So, we'll take them out of their little containers and then we're gonna put them in the ground. I'm gonna plant them kind of far apart, kind of close together because I plan on eating them as they come out, but not eating the whole plant. So, what do, you, what do they call that? I forgot. I was trying to figure out the word whenever we went to that feed store, but. Not eat and go, what is it? Something, I don't know. I, I forgot. Ooh, hello, look how pretty. So pretty, look at the roots, how beautiful. I love roots. Denim Ivy, what are you doing? How pretty. The leaves are so pretty in the light. Yes. Mm. A snail. Goodbye, snail. You are not welcome here. She threw it. Gross snail. Denim. All right. my ghetto I'm not gonna get rid of the shovel I'm actually gonna put it in this look at this you ever see the other piece the ghetto what you call this I don't know if I'm gonna plant these onions today To do a summer garden but we did a fall garden because this summer we weren't here we were in memphis at st jude for my son's bone marrow transplant which he totally rocked that's a whole long story but glory to god we are home and we're gardening again at my favorite time of day i don't know where to put this but yeah that was a whole thing that we got through through prayer and faith. Um, I don't know where to put this last onion. 
I have them close together in my last garden. And I was trying to space them out so they can look kind of like pretty or whatever. Because I like pretty things. But I don't know. I don't know. Where should I put you? Where should I put you? Maybe next to Helga. We stick it as the bird. Right here. Just watering by the roots because this soil is bone, bone, bone dry. So we made this gardening box out of pellets, obviously. And I just threw a few little pellets of fertilizer, like I always do when I start a garden. I know you're supposed to probably wait until this time or that time, but I always fertilizing my garden when I first started when I first put the things around just a few pieces and it always does it never had a problem you put uh, coffee grinds in here eggshells banana water water we had soaking and bananas peels also I never planted lettuce before but I've been studying and researching it like I always do when I plant something in it says that you can plant them kind of close together if, if you're kind of eating it like frequently. We're a family of seven, four kids, two adults, and one four-legged um, child. So, you know, we eat a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. So, anyways, so I don't, I put it, I put it how I wanted it to go. I might move it around tomorrow or something. Uh, as I go to sleep tonight and look at some other gardens like on Pinterest and YouTube, I might separate them. Um, but this is my blue kale. This is our onion tops or... Whatever y'all, we call them onion tops, uh, French onions. I don't know y'all. So they're just along. So we eat them all the time. I've grown them like a thousand times. I plant them close together sometimes. Sometimes I plant them far apart. They always grow, doesn't matter. And this is a uh, blue kale, I already said that, blue kale. Um, this is Scottish kale, Scottish kale, or Scot kale. Scotch kale, I said Scottish. And this is arugula. I'm not sure how big arugula gets, so I'm gonna, I don't know. Cause I wanted my herbs in the front. So if this is an herb, y'all, don't make fun of me. I just know that it's a good spice with, with salad. So that's why I planted it. What's, What's that? I that's arugula also. Uh -uh. So I might move it. These are some seeds that we started from, some little seedlings that we started from seeds. This is uh, turnips. And must, this are, these are turnips. So I'm gonna thin them out probably tomorrow and put them in this box right here. I'm not sure. I don't know. I'm the queen of I don't know, but I always make it work through God through patience, through all that. So, this is our little garden that we're starting. We had to uh, we had to restart the garden. Um, we started a garden, I like to call it like a faith garden. Before we went to Memphis for Yates' uh, bone marrow transplant, we planted a garden because we were believing and trusting God that we would be back to see it. And y'all, it was covered in green beans and stink bugs. And it was beautiful and also- Sunflowers, and some, taller than us. Yes. The sunflowers, our, our sweet neighbor had posted pictures of it versus he was in Memphis. The, our sunflowers got super big. So we were just believing that we would see, see it before the season ended and we did, glory to God. So we had to wipe, we had to cut the, the, the whole thing down, take out all the garden boxes because it was overtaken by weeds and rot and wet and wood and beetles. So this is brand new. We started from, we're starting from scratch. Yates' immune system is brand new. So our garden's brand new. I was kind of sad when we cut the old one down but I was also very thankful. So I'm praying in Jesus' name that this garden does really well. I know it will through God because, you know, I trust him. So, yeah. Oh, did I tell you these were uh, onion, uh, um, onion, chives? onion chives right oh, here? Oh, wait, hold on. Y'all didn't tell her to start the show? Oh, this is Helga. She's sticking the bird. We love her. She's really hood. She's really ghetto. She got a little bit of cleavage showing like me. We don't do it on purpose. We don't do it on purpose. That's our girl. I got it for my birthday, like. Three. I think it was the year before last. Yeah. Or no, I think it was last year. It wasn't oh this yeah, year. it was. It was. I think it was before we Yates was diagnosed. Yeah. Was it? Yeah. So anyway, 
I'm gonna repaint her, but yeah. So the bottom of our garden bed, we started off with, I'm gonna do a video on that too, but we started off with, uh, we did the fabric sheets, the garden cover, then we put cardboard on top, then we put branches inside. So tomorrow I'm gonna do a little video of how we, we're gonna put this, this uh, bed together tomorrow. And I'll do a video on that, but yeah. This is a, uh, what do we name our little scarecrow? Oh, I forgot. Her name is a, uh, we don't remember. We'll put her name at the bottom of here. I don't know how it goes. Um, but yeah, so. You told, show them the uh, mustard seeds, oh, the mustard greens. We yeah, have some mustard greens. That we started from seed. Yeah, right there. And we're gonna send them out later. Right there. Mm -hmm. And some are right turnips. there. These are mustard also? These are turnips. Okay. These are mustard. Uh -huh. uh, turnips and a random green bean from the old soil. Yeah, we got to pick that up. And yeah, is. these are right here is just turnips and so, mustard greens. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna actually go do, I wanna do a bed of parsley because we use parsley a lot. And every time I have to bite at the store, I roll my eyes and I cringe. So I'm gonna go throw some seeds in an empty box right now and uh, just wet it a little bit. And uh, I'll do an update video on that as well. Might as well do it right now because every day that goes by that I don't toss them in there, that's the day we don't have parsley. So you're gonna do it now? Yes. Do it. Okay. Okay, where's our parsley? Yoshi, you chilling by an ant pile? All right, have fun. <laughs> Bag of parsley we got from our local seed store here in Louisiana. I'm just gonna sprinkle it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna sprinkle it in here, y'all. Look. You gonna sprinkle it in there? This little thing right here. Oh, did, no! You already put some right there. I did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It says parsley. Okay, well, I'm gonna just do a few more on top, and I'm gonna thin them out as we go, cause I kind of messed with the soil just now when I was working. Mm. All right, and I'm gonna throw some. That's the ba basil. Yeah. Yeah. That's my basil. It smells so delicious. You think I should cover this box with some parsley? Yeah. Throw some Cause that parsley's in that. There's parsley in those in there too. So. Yeah, these are some baby parsley. Oh yeah, and then that row is some mustard greens, and then the rest of the rows are parsley. Yeah. I didn't. I didn't. I need to water them. As a matter of fact. Yeah, they look dry. Yeah. Even though I'm pretty sure I watered them earlier, but you know the sun, it's a deadly laser. It is. It is. Okay. So we'll scoot you back here. Oh, wow. I'm gonna just drizzle some on top. Why don't you just wait till tomorrow so we can do it like this? Okay. Look. Well, in the front? Yeah, like okay. the other ones. Well, I kind of just do some seeds right there. I know, I saw. Well, I have a lot, so who cares? Who cares? This is a learning process. We learn as we go. Anyway, so. Um, Get away from me. If at first you don't sit seed, dust yourself off and try again. Aaliyah. Also. Are we still recording? Yeah. Okay. Um, Peace, blessings, all the fruits of the Holy Spirit upon you. Um, I love you. This is my first video, so I love you all, even though there's literally negative zero, negative two subscribers. Um, I'm just waiting for you to stop recording so that I may go in the house. I'm still recording. I'm trying to keep.